Welcome back to Asterix, where aces share tricks for Alteryx users. Today, we are going to talk about using a template. In some cases, you have your data, but it's changing because it's a manual file and you want it to be neat, you want it to be proper. So one way to do this is to use a template file. To generate a template file, it will allow you to keep your data and your metadata really proper, as you expect. And to do so, it's quite easy. Just put the data in the format you want. So let's say you've got like five or six columns. You put the right types and then you filter your data to zero values. For instance, if you've got like a row ID, just filter on raw ID is no, so that you don't have any data in your stream. You then can output this to a YXDB format, which is Alteryx database format. And with this format, you can use it as an input in your data stream or in an overflow, and then connect it with a union so that you make sure you always have those columns and you don't run into an error because like there is a missing field on this manual file you received from accountancy or whoever sent it to you. Thank you for tuning in to this Asterix tips and tricks and see you for the next one.